Uh, everyone's seen that video now, of the, that 12-year-old girl asking the preacher to explain the inconsistencies with, with the dictionary description of Jesus and the Bible's description of Jesus. And you saw how he attacked her. How dare you question my faith? Well, first of all, she didn't question his faith. She questioned him as a person. She put him in a position that he had to take responsibility for the dictionary and the Bible at the same time. And he had to deny both at the same time. That little girl knew what's going on. She laid him bare with one simple question. Uh, all she did was use the dictionary and the Bible at the same time. And you saw his reaction right there. See how he attacked her? That's evil. Okay? If that was my daughter, I'd have beat the guy senseless. He'd have been out in the parking lot. We would have tarred and feathered him and, and take him to town and kicked him out of town and made him an, 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 an outcast for that behavior. You know? He's a wretch. He was, he's a wretched human being. He treated that girl in a wretched way. That's evil. He is a cretin. He treated that child wretchedly. So he should be outcast. They should not let him continue to speak and, and, and vomit his, 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 his evil onto those people. They should have stood up to that man and kicked the shit out of him. Right then and there. Okay? That's called holding him responsible for free will. He just exercised his free will when he attacked that child. They called me Lucifer and kicked me out of Sunday school for, for the same thing. That's the exact same thing they did to me. I was asking innocent questions. I was just simply trying to, to get him to explain how he could ignore the dictionary and the Bible at the same time and they he freaked he couldn't do it he just couldn't do it that's how you deal with a narcissist you keep you keep pounding away on a narcissist with 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 both sides of every story and you watch a narcissist deny deny everything deny 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 lie deny ah! all right there you go man it's it's that's it she triggered that man with one simple question. Boom! Well, she found out the truth, didn't she? See how that works? She asked him one question and he answered her honestly. He showed her evil. That little girl just learned evil right there, man. Right there in front of her was Satan. There you go. A narcissist always tells on himself. You want to understand conservatives, study narcissism. And you'll think, wow, that's the, the same thing. That's synonymous. I mean, it's, it's, it's so synonymous, it's redundant. You know, calling a narcissist conservative and calling a, 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 a conservative narcissist, now, now it's redundant. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I'm a scientist. This is what I do in the morning. I get up and I do science. I'm just in a position where I can apply all my knowledge to any single situation simultaneously. So I do it. All. All. There's the key to being logical, man. You have to use all your education. All the time. On every problem. Check my math. 